If you're trying to avoid eating a lot of meats, as well as white flours and processed foods, it's important to have healthy standbys on hand so that you have something to go to. Now this could be whether you're trying to lose weight, gain muscle, or just eat healthier. I usually have a container of mixed greens cut up on hand, such as kale, cilantro, parsley, purple cabbage, and a couple of other greens that will last a few days. Unlike cucumber and tomatoes that will go bad faster, well, I'll just cut those up and put those in when I have time. A great way to go with this is just to add some olive oil, a little avocado, sea salt, hemp seeds, nutritional yeast, and then you have a great salad in just under a few minutes. Some other standby foods I have are sprouted quinoa, sprouted lentils, sprouted beans, and you can see my video on how to sprout those. Also beets because they're dense and they're filling, and I usually eat those raw, eggs, nuts, as well as cruciferous vegetables that I'll usually saute, and I'm talking about broccoli, cauliflower, purple cabbage, and they have videos on how to roast all of those. But just so you know, I've never been a big fan of any of these foods until I learned how to make them right. And now I eat cauliflower rice on a daily basis because it's fast, easy, and super healthy. Now you can use this as a replacement for rice, as well as a great side dish for grilled or sauteed vegetables. Or if you're trying to lose weight or something like that, it's even great as a meal by itself, just add some spices. Now always buy cauliflower organic since it's very easy for pesticides to get inside the florets. Now this is great by itself with some spices, but I like to saute some onion and garlic in the pan first for about five minutes. Now you can cut this right over the top of the pan on the go, or even easier, just cut off the florets and put it in a food processor. And blend for about 30 seconds until they're all cut up. This is sauteed great with coconut oil. Then add the cauliflower and saute that for about five to 10 minutes at medium heat. You can brown it depending on your taste and sometimes I even like to burn it a little. Since the flavor of cauliflower is very subtle, you could add whatever spices you like. And as mentioned in other videos, I like to think of this as a vehicle to get healthy herbs and spices into my body. So I like to add Himalayan pink salt, ginger, turmeric, and rosemary. And just simple salt and pepper will work too. Just don't use table salt because that's so bad for you and Himalayan pink salt is so good. And I'll even add a little bit of pure water so that it steams a bit. And then just add some chopped parsley at the end and that's great as well. Now I'll have this with sprouted quinoa or lentils. You can add eggs or grilled chicken and it's a fast, super healthy meal. Now for a really healthy risotto, Start out with a couple tablespoons full of coconut oil. Saute the onions, then the garlic, then the mushrooms. I like to add about two tablespoons full of organic grass-fed butter, preferably unpasteurized, but you can leave that out. Then add a large head of cauliflower rice and a cup of broth. You can use chicken or vegetable. Then about a half a teaspoon of Himalayan pink salt or ground pepper for taste. Optional ingredient here is about a half a cup of red wine. Then cover and let sit for about five to 10 minutes. And you can add Parmesan or mozzarella cheese to this if you like, or vegan equivalents. And nutritional yeast goes great on here as well. Add some parsley and you're done. Now even people who don't eat healthy love this risotto. And in the next video, we're gonna talk about how to make a delicious cauliflower fried rice that's simple and fast as well. Now, you have a super healthy meal that's very simple and you're only limited by your creativity on how elaborate you wanna make it. So I hope you try this because it's great for putting your health in a positive direction and especially if you're trying to lose weight. So for more videos on health and wellness related to mind, body, and spirit, don't forget to subscribe and check out theartofunity.com. Good luck with this.